Here in this video, let us look into some of the properties of triangles when the triangles are on the same base and they are between the same parallels. Now, the first property would be triangles on the same base and between the same parallels are equal in area. That is what the first property says. Now, say, for example, we have one base, okay, and then we have another line parallel to the base, say something like this. Now, these two lines are not going to meet each other. Now, let us make triangles out of this base, say something like this to start off with. So, now, let us make another triangle of the same base. Now, say something like this. Now, these two triangles look completely different, but the fact is they lie on the same base. Let me name them as well. Say, let this be A, B, and C. Let the blue triangle be E, B, and C. So, now, coming back to the two triangles, say the triangle E, B, C, and A, B, C are completely different to look at. Now, but the thing is, they lie on the same base and also between two lines that are not going to meet each other. Or... In other words, they are between two parallel lines. So, when this kind of a condition is in place, then the areas of these two triangles are going to be equal. That is what the first property says. Let me repeat the property again. Triangles on the same base. So, triangle ABC and triangle EBC are on the same base. And when they are between the same parallels, this and this line are parallels, then the areas of the two triangles are equal. This is what the first property says. Now, let us go to the second property. Triangles having equal areas and having one side of one of the triangles equal to one side of the other have their corresponding altitudes equal. Now, say for example, let me draw two triangles of equal areas. Start off, this is one triangle. Let's say we have another triangle of the same area. So, let this be A, B, C and let this be E, F, G. So, these are the two triangles. Now, what does it say? Now, triangles having equal areas and having one side of one of the triangles equal to one side of the other. Now, say for example, now definitely you can see that all the three sides of the triangle A, B, C are not equal to the three sides of the, three sides of the triangle E, F, G. So, let us consider one side which is close to equal. To me, it looks like AB is equal to EF. Others are not equal. AC is not equal to EG. It doesn't look like at least. BC is not exactly equal to FG. It looks a little longer than FG. So, let us take AB equal to EF. Now, what does this statement say? It says triangles having equal area. So, we are convinced that ABC is equal in area to EFG and having one side of one of the triangles equal to the one side of the other. So, one side of the triangle ABC is AB and one side of the triangle EFG is EF. So, AB being equal to EF, then they have their corresponding altitudes equal. So, now this is the altitude and this is the altitude here. Let us name them. Say, let this be D. Let that be H. So, AD is equal to EH. That is what the second property says. So, we have another property here. Let us go to the other property now. Now, the third property states that two triangles having the same base. Let us draw two triangles. Say, one triangle has a base BC, another triangle has same or equal bases. Having the same base or equal bases. Let me consider equal bases. So, let me take this as EF. Uh, now, two triangles having the same base or equal base, I'm taking equal bases. So, having equal bases and equal areas. Let me draw two triangles equal in areas to each other. That is something like this. Yeah, this looks simple to draw. So, yeah, the areas of the triangles EFG and the areas of the triangles ABC are equal and they have equal bases. Now, in this case, now, two triangles having the same base and equal areas, they lie between the same parallel lines. That's what it says. So, now what this means is, now if we join the two ends of this triangles, then the line BC and EF are parallel to this line AG. That is what it says. So, now consider equal bases. Now, let us consider same base and see what it means. So, let us say we have a base AB. And then say we have two triangles on top of this of equal areas. 
the triangle ABC and triangle EBA. Now the condition here is both the triangles lie on the same base and they have equal areas. So now what if they are like that? If they are like that, then it means that they lie between two parallel lines. So that is what it means. So the lines AB and CE are parallel to each other. So this ends the properties of triangles when they are on the same base and when they lie between the two parallel lines.